uh, four groups. We will start by making a sweat. Now you're experts, you know how to make a sweat. Either with cipolla or with the uh, aglio. My recommendation would be that the people who are using the radicchio would make the sweat with aglio, while for the others, I think cipolla would be better. Then the next step will consist in taking the riso, and uh, we, we will mix it and uh, we will toast it a tiny bit. After that, we will add the broth. So while the sweat is cooking, you will have to prepare some broth. And uh, I will tell you then all the details, all the other details on the way. Good. You have cutting boards. They are on the other side of the kitchen. Wash your hands. Ready, set, go. Cucinamo. it a tiny bit but we don't want it to stick we just toast it for a minute <laughs> and you now add we the start dado? adding yeah we already added the dado <laughs> and now we can start legs. adding <laughs> water boiling like water ready so here we have oh, boiling water oh, after we add Come. the water we stir but then we just leave it, let, leave it. and then yeah let it simmer. simmer so we keep adding hot water and we stir every I don't know, four or five minutes. And when it's ready, how do we know when it's ready? Taste it. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> taste it. We eat it. <laughs> we taste a tiny bit and we decide. And we may also have to add salt. Most likely, you will have to add a little bit of salt. So you taste it, you decide, hmm, is it hard? Is it 
soft, do I need to add a little bit of salt? So here it's different from when we make pasta. When we make pasta, we put a lot of salt because then we get rid of the water. With the risotto, we keep everything in the same pot. So when you add salt, you really add just a pinch at a time. Oh, really? Yeah, I, I do want to go back. Come on. How is it? No, really, it's a good thing. I wouldn't mind. I want to try all of them. So, the asparagus one needs a little bit of salt. As far as your spoon's going. Alright, asparagus. This one needs to be stirred or it will stick. Oh, okay. And you need a little bit of salt. So, okay. <laughs> Maybe you could you could have another bright one to put some salt in there. A pinch of, we need to add a pinch of salt in the uh, pungen zafferano and a pinch of salt in the asparagus. When the rice is almost ready, we will take about a teaspoon full of butter and then per pot. Stir and add the uh, We will do this away almost, from the fire. It's almost ready and we're the close there. Yeah. 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 Yeah.